In 2009, Forbes magazine ranked her the 17th most powerful woman on the planet. The same year, the Financial Times labeled her the best finance minister in Europe. She is the French woman who once ran a large American law firm and the lawyer who runs an even larger French economy. And yet, Christine Lagarde, who shepherded tough economic reforms, was recently ranked France's sixth most popular political figure. So how does the former synchronized swimming champion manage it? A friend and fellow lawyer says it's a combination of personality and competence. One, she's somebody who listens to people. Two, she's very human. She's very just, high ethics, which are important uh, because I think in the end it's always ethical people who, who really lead others. The author of a recent book about Lagarde says many people don't know that she's a devout Catholic who tells herself constantly to keep smiling. It has, he believes, carried her through some tough situations. But Cyril Lechev also says that Lagarde, at age 55, after a divorce and a separation and long periods away from her two sons, now has some regrets. She sacrificed a lot of things for her career. And this is something, when you speak with her, um, she, doesn't think, she doesn't feel very good with this. Now, when she looks back, she, she has the feeling that she, she missed something. But in her public life, she has missed little. She's widely credited for working around the clock to head off the financial crisis of 2008, something that put her in a recent documentary on the financial meltdown called Inside Job. When were you first told that Lehman, in fact, was going to go bankrupt? Uh, after the fact. After the fact. Wow. Okay. Um, and what was your reaction when you learned of it? Holy cow. For her involvement back then and in the subsequent European debt problems, she has won the confidence of many of the leaders of the planet, some of whom now support her candidacy for director of the International Monetary Fund, a job at which many in France believe she would excel. Christine Lagarde is really able when people are around the table, like lawyers, you know, uh, people that have the feeling that are, they are really important. She, she, she always managed to get consensus. And she doesn't stand in front of the other. She always builds this consensus. Consensus building is no doubt a valuable skill at an organization like the International Monetary Fund, but the first consensus Lagarde is going to have to build there is one among the IMF's Board of Governors common agreement that they should once again turn to France for their director. Jim Bitterman, CNN, Paris.